so our next cooking class is Indonesian nasi goreng, which nasi goreng is like fried rice. This is a really easy uh, recipe and you'll be able to easily buy these products in Australian or US or UK um, supermarkets. We're not using anything super fancy, it's just a basic fried rice but super tasty. So the simple ingredients you'll need are a little bit of chicken, which the chicken you just simply cut into slices like that and then just small little cubes like that. Okay, then we have some garlic. So we only need one really big thing of garlic. Just squash it with your, like that, and then simply cut. Doesn't matter if it's huge hunks, they all taste good. Okay, so that's cut up enough. We'll put that over here. Yeah. onto the plate. So what we've done is we've got a little plate that we've got everything on it just so that when we go to the uh, actual stove it's all ready on one plate. So the next things, the, the vegetables I've got is a bit of cabbage and I've got some cut up carrot, once again shallots, two shallots and this is like Chinese bok choy. So you can use bok choy, you can use Chinese cabbage, but bok choy is probably better. So you just cut these up. The bok choy just cut up in little... Because this stuff goes down to nothing. Put it on the plate. The carrots. And then next we've got the carrots, which have been nicely cut up into little julians. We can cut these spring onions up just like we did for the spring rolls. Nice and fine. And then the cabbage. We'll cut that nice and fine too. So now you just have to lightly season this chicken with a bit of salt and a bit of pepper. Just so that you get a nice bit of flavour to that. The sauces that we're going to be using, that's oyster sauce, uh, that's a chilli sauce, you can buy it in uh, Coles or Woolworths, that's uh, ketchup asin which is just normal salty soy sauce. And this is sweet soya sauce, which we call ketchup manas. And here, sesame seed oil, just one teaspoon. Yeah, and this here is nasi, which, we, which is rice. So cooked rice, already cooked, ready to go. Okay, so we're gonna fry it all up now, making this lovely fried rice. So you have about two tablespoons of oil into a hot pan. And then here, so this is the chicken, which has been lightly seasoned with salt and pepper, into the oil. So we're gonna cook that up. All right, now the garlic. Yum, lots of garlic. Just get that fried up a little. Yeah, wait till we get that lovely smell of garlic. Oh, it smells beautiful. Okay, now the carrot. Okay. Cook that off a little bit. Yum. Everything else. So then everything else goes in there. The cabbage, the bok choy, the spring onion. Beautiful. Fry that off. Rice. 
then you, all your rice. So this is about two cups of rice, uh, two cups two of, portions, two portions of rice, two cups of rice, and then you cook the rice. So all of the rice, you can either do it the day before, Ooh. And mix all your ingredients together. Mate is getting very frustrated watching me. <laughs> so all of these sauces, there's approximately one teaspoon of sesame oil, one teaspoon of ketchup asin. This here, two, two teaspoons of uh, chilli sauce. If you like it hot, you can make it a little bit less. If you don't like it hot, one teaspoon of oyster sauce and one big slurp, maybe two of uh, ketchup atom, which is sweet soy sauce. Pepper. Pepper. How much pepper? Just a bit, not too much. About a quarter of a teaspoon of pepper. All right, mix it all through. <laughs> Mate's going, here Mate, here, you have a go, you mix. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he's getting very frustrated. So now Mate's mixing it all through, making it all uh, nice and combined. And uh, it's just about ready to eat. It's, we would call this nasi goreng AM, which is fried rice chicken or chicken fried rice. Oh, yummy. So how long do you have to actually cook that like that, Madame? Only... Uh, Maybe four uh, minutes, three uh, minutes? Five minutes. Five minutes? Uh, so this is a very familiar sound that you hear in the kitchens. This that sort of noise. Everywhere in Indonesia you can hear it. It's like a Chinese restaurant. You hear the woks and they're making their lovely nasi goreng or fried rice. So you just got to fry it off for about five minutes. I think this is the best nasi goreng I've ever made, Mado. <laughs> so this is just about finished. We've been cooking it for about five minutes. And look at that. Absolutely beautiful nasi goreng. Ayam which is chicken fried rice, Indonesian style. So now we're gonna serve it up. And of course, everything's about the serving. So we have to have a lovely presentation. So this is the, whoops, couple of spoonfuls there. Clean up the mess. We'll move this over the way. couple of slices of tomato just to make it look pretty an egg of course you no Indonesian fried rice is an Indonesian fried rice without an egg so an egg on top and a beautiful like a crispy we call krupuk but uh, you can use shrimp shrimp uh, crisps can't remember what you call them, shrimp. This rice. But this is a rice, a rice uh, done with dried rice and then they deep fry it. But we, we, in Australia, we can buy like little shrimp crackers and fry them up. So that's our lovely Indonesian fried rice or Indonesian nasi goreng AM. Salamat makan. Okay, that concludes our cooking class. We've done our amazing spring rolls and we've done our Indonesian nasi goreng ayam. So I'd like to thank Mada, who's an amazing uh, chef at Lazat restaurant, which is part of the Ashiani, Ashiana group. And uh, like, where could we be somewhere more beautiful in the world than Chandidasa? Thank you very much and I hope you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm.